thank you. Let's check out Chicago's starting lineup. They've got Vucevic, DeRozan out there with Williams, then it's Zach Levine, and it's Caruso in at the point guard position. And for the Bucks, the big men on the floor, Giannis and Lopez. And the wings for him, Matthews and Middleton. And it's Holiday in at the point. Tip-off goes to Milwaukee. And Middleton gets to Holland. Nice ball movement by Milwaukee. Levine against Matthews. Here's Young. Five to shoot. And Matthews gets it to go in on the assist from Adekumbo. Excellent demonstration there. Squaring himself up towards the basket. a good start as he hits his first shot attempt. And once he got to the 10, I think he was surprised to find himself that wide open. Well, this early, they should be showing a lot more energy on defense. It's not there. Middleton dishes to Matthews. And the Kumbo looking over the floor. Over Williams. Off the left rim and out. You're not going to see that very often. Plenty of space, but he just, let's face it, he whips on it. Back to DeRozan. Lopez with the steal. Middleton on the wing. For the three. No good. And the Bulls going the other way now. They come into this game after losing on Saturday. I mean, a tough one. Uh, faced some serious intensity in terms of that comeback, and they just got overwhelmed in that fourth quarter. Uh, unfortunately, just couldn't stay in the game long enough to force overtime. Even with the defense right on top of it, I mean, Vucevic maintained a nice soft touch on these inside shots. So the concentration is not to be overlooked either. Really well done there. Just confident and composed. Never in a hurry. From the baseline. That one a little long. The box is on two for four from the field so far today. Gets it to go from beyond the arc. Holiday step by him. Boy, sometimes Holiday makes it look so easy. Automatic. Able to pull up on a moment's notice. Here's Caruso, guarded by Holiday. Caruso, the pass to Levine. And they wasted no time getting those three points back. Five points in the game. And an eye for an eye. Both teams working to stretch the floor. Nothing like answering back. One team gets three, you fire three of your own. Boom. And that one's good by Dennis. Not the Caruso showing his versatility yet again. His dribble moves are virtually unguarded. Arderosa on the wing. Inside. Here's Vucevic over Lopez. Lopez with the block. Outside, out of the Kumbo. Pass to Middleton. Shoots over to Rosa. Five on the shot and picks up two points. So one free throw coming up. Oh, I tell you what, Middleton really does a nice job at being able to score through contact. Sometimes he gets hammered and he still gets it up and down. And this is his first trip to the line tonight. At the line for the box, Chris Middleton. At the line for one. Middleton, oh good on the free throw. Middleton so highly productive and consistent. A steady contributor night in and night out. Matthews against Williams. And the pass to Middleton. Trying to get open is open. And Middleton, the basket on the assist by Matthew. And their offense already in a flow. Some stellar shooting to jump out to this one. Quality looks they're getting and they're capitalizing on them, guys. They have to be happy with this start offensively. DeRozan against Matthews. Here's Young. And he makes the bucket, gets the whistle, and now a three-point play chance here for him. That's their third straight make off an assist. 
First trip to the free throw line for him tonight. Nikola Butovic. That's his first personal foul. Second team foul. At the line for the box. Giannis Antetokounmpo. One shot. During his 2019-2020 MVP season, Giannis Antetokounmpo led the Bucks to back-to-back -back one seeds in the East. The Greek Freaks defense helping Milwaukee to number one defensive rating each of those years, too. Here's Caruso, guarded by Holiday. Lucevic set the pick for Levine. Looking to end the run, and that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle, and two shots coming up. In the seven-foot frame of Vucevic, uh, creates a lot of problems, causes a lot of problems with the finish, especially when he's close to the bucket. Bulls shooting their first free throws of the game on this trip to the line. Shooting two. Free throw, no good. Wow, but what, did he have something in his eye on that shot? <laughs> you know what, that time either. You know, very quiet. Vucevic puts up phenomenal numbers, consistent. A nightly double-double threat who, you know, bullies opposing defenses on the regular. Kumbo kicks to Matthews. Good. And it's Giannis picking up the assist. Giannis has got the assist now in this one. Time out for the ball. The loudest and craziest fans get a free t-shirt. Let's see it, man. All right. Push it coming out of the court. Go on and get down for your fight. Bulls trail by 13. Outside, Levine. Pass to DeRozan. And for Middleton, DeRozan's shot is off. On offense, here are the Bucks. They're on a 20-7 run. Here's Young, ripped away. Last break, here comes Chicago. And the foul on Drew Holiday. That'll be his second foul of the game. 
And really, these are some of the toughest calls an official has to make. Yeah, but in this case, I think you got it right. I mean, the defender was still moving there and never really had good legal guarding position. He wasn't set. The Bucks making a switch here. Carter's checked in. Thirteen feet away, DeRozan gets the bucket. Boy, that looks like a scouting report breakdown there. I mean, the defense has to know where DeRozan wants to do the most work. That's his sweet spot there. Bucks passing it around. Carter, the pass to Middleton. Lopez outside. No good from outside. And it's DeRozan with the ball for Chicago. They trail by 11. Passes to Vucevic. They set the pick. The shot. Lopez with the block. Lopez showing off the length there to get to that shot. Outside DeRozan. Five on the clock. That's it. He's got two made now, and he's shooting two for three. You know, the athleticism is obvious when you look at DeRozan's game, but he also has tremendous strength, and wasn't much the defender could do there. Matthews, a screen on Williams, puts it up from 15. He gets it in there. Miles has got seven points. And you can't help but pick their defense apart. They're completely in disarray. Well, everything's coming too easily. At some point, defensively, you have to take something away. Back to Vucevic. Second chance shot. And it's sent back by Lopez. Well, he has not been sharp this period. Seems to be a little flustered out there, too. And Matthews gets it to go. I like their focus coming in. Terrific execution so far. And you know, it's an all-out effort they've come in with. Very aggressive offense so far. DeRozan finds Vucevic. Back to DeRozan. Williams with the ball. To the middle. Here's Caruso. And he drops in the way off the glass. Yeah, another nice bucket down low. They've really been able to work the ball into the post effectively here so far. Austin Matthew back to Lopez. And here's Giannis. It is now to Lopez. Offline with his three. Levine feeling it out of it. And it's sent back by Lopez. Middleton against DeRozan. Back to Antetokounmpo. He's looking for Lopez and finds him. Goes up the baseline. It's all in by the Bulls. Vucevic has got his fourth rebound in this one. Bobs it up for Levine. A nice room service for Levine from DeRozan. Couldn't get more wide open than that. Bucks leading by nine. Antetokounmpo gets to Middleton. Giannis dishes to Middleton. And again, the Bucks miss. Chicago's gone one or two from long range in the first quarter. DeRozan dances to Levine. Matthews against Williams. And Matthews gets it to go in on the assist by Ante de Kumbo. Ante de Kumbo's got four assists now tonight. So Chicago calls timeout. some changes. Portis, he's checked in for Lopez. Pat Connaughton comes in for Chris Middleton. And Allen subbed in for Matthews. And the whistle blows. It'll be on Pat Connaughton. That is his first foul of the game. His shot was hindered by that momentous mobile one block. Well, they didn't make it this far by giving up easy ones. And now they're defending. is 
in overdrive. The pass to Dozuma. Outside, Green. Here's Thompson. First shot, first pass. He's out of the blocks fast. Well, we've seen that movie a few times, haven't we? An easy bucket in the paint. Well, listless and lifeless at the defensive end. I mean, especially inside. They've really got to pick up that interior defense. Well, what a quarter for him. I mean, he's found his rhythm, and he's really riding that wave right now. It's White on the wing. That's his first personal foul. First team foul. Green passes to Thompson. Now here's Dosumu. Thompson a screen on court. And there's the drive. In, in trailing here in the first, you'd like to see them be a little more aggressive on the offensive play. Yeah, I agree. Not a lot of activity chasing down their misses. Some teams focus on getting back on playing that, but you should send at least one guy up. Defensively, they've been a step slow here to start. Giving up too many open shots. I mean, that's what's happening here. They look to me to be a bit sluggish. That's his first personal foul. Third team foul. At the line for Milwaukee. Giannis Antetokounmpo. Shooting one. getting an opponent on the ropes early. You love that if you're on that side of the scoreboard and they are landing some haymakers now. And what body control, even when White gets bodied up, he sticks with his shot. From deep, Giannis. And Jones pulls it down. You know, defensively, you just can't afford to give him that much room. They're fortunate that he missed that one. Takes it inside. Dosunmu shots good. Dosunmu. And so it's Carter who brings the ball up for Milwaukee. It's a 13-point game. On the wing, Young. Six to shoot. Carter to shoot to Giannis. And the tuck by Giannis. Giannis continues to expand his offensive arsenal. And with that, his confidence and ability can actually take over more. Thompson kicks to White. 107 left here in the opening quarter. Thompson sets the pick for White. And it's wide right. Hits off the rim. Milwaukee leading by 15. Giannis passes to Connaughton. Portis the screen. Here's Connaughton, covered by Green. On the Kumbo, a screen on Green. And it's Connaughton missing. Bulls trail by 15. It's Jones on the way. It's stolen by Allen. It's nine seconds separating the shot clock and Duke. Thompson sends it back. Now here's Dosumu, defended by Carter. And again, Chicago turns it over. Ball. Six 
17 seconds left in the first quarter. Jones against Adekumbo. Count the bucket, and he's got a free throw coming up as well. Boy, for such a young player, the razor-sharp focus of Adekumbo is really impressive. He's a muscular guy who still makes baskets despite getting hit in the process. He's not wide, but he is muscular. One shot. No good on the last second attempt there. And so it's the no one. lead as the quarter comes to a close. They've got their field goal percentage to thank for that. They've been hot from all over the floor tonight. And don't go away. We'll be right back. for a long time, you know, we have much more depth than I think people realize. You know, I honestly think through the roster 1 to 15, you have guys that, you know, would be rotation players on any other team. And he's a prime example. Former second round pick continuing to improve. Refining his perimeter shot, Kevin. And as we've seen, he can play above the rim as well. And glad to have you with us as we get going here in game two. In a moment now to quickly take a look at the offensive approach for Milwaukee. Boy, the three-point shot has really been dropping for him early on. And also, it's been a positive to watch that they've attacked the paint offensively as well. It's really a bit about the balance that they've shown. So the Bulls five right now. Michael Levine on the wing. Vucevic is out there at the Rosa. And it's Caruso in at the point. Levine passes to Caruso. To Rosen against Giannis. At the elbow, Vucevic has to Caruso. Shot clock at five. The Bulls need to get a shot off here. And it's White missing. And he didn't punish them for the weak coverage there, but they can count on him to continue missing. And, you know, the defense to me looked like they were okay to let him prove he could make that shot. That one, good. White's got his second bucket of the game to go. Yeah, attacking the interior is something White does well. He's crafty, and he makes good adjustments against the defense. Pass to Giannis. Holiday looking for an opening. Back to Andrikumbo. And they double up Giannis. That's a two for Matthews. And Levine with the poison. Chicago ball. Brooke Lopez is checked in for Milwaukee. Bulls trail by 16. Here's Caruso. Drives to the hoop. No good that time. Great D that time for Middleton. Outside Holiday. He kicks the net to the inside. Over Levine. And there's Lopez. That's good on the assist by Matthews. Matthews has got three assists now in this one. 
Caruso, the pass to Vucevic. And here in the second quarter of action with a hair under two and a half minutes played so far. He's again, and it's good on the way in. Vucevic. Vucevic has got his second basket of the night. Yeah, you know, one of the best parts of Nikola Vucevic's game is his great body, excellent hands, and the high motor makes him an outstanding rebound. Bombs it up for Levine. And so the ball's out of bounds. Middleton touched it last. And gets a finger on it, but just can't quite come up with the steal. Clearly a careless pass. He got away with one there. Patrick Williams, he's checked in for White. Caruso kicks to Williams. Vucevic is screen on Matthews. Williams passes to Vucevic. Lock at six. Here's Caruso. Count that one. Again and again, they're dissecting the defense and creating those high percentage looks from inside. And even under pressure in close, I think they've still done a good job maintaining concentration and converting the opportunities. Holiday with it. Now guarded by Vucevic. And the foul on Drew Holiday. That and that'll be his third foul so far. Yeah, way to get there first and be willing to absorb the contact. No question about it. No flop there. That was a direct shot to the chest. Caruso kicks to Vucevic on the wing, Levine. Pass to DeRozan. Shoots over Portis. It's deflected, and he gets it back. DeRozan's shot is off. Bucks leading by 14. Outside Holiday. Shot from 12. And Vucevic pulls it down. Vucevic has got his sixth rebound on the night. Outside DeRozan. Caruso, the pass to Vucevic. Vucevic set the pick for Williams over Holiday. Williams, that's good. It works well there. Not much resistance from the D. Yeah, that's not the defense you need. You've got to be tougher defensively. Holiday finds Matthews. Opens against Vucevic. Back to Matthews. They need this one. And the shot falls short this time. And so Levine will bring it up now for Chicago. Only giving up two points this quarter. Williams, a screen on Hubbard. Caruso kicks to Levine. Who's back up? Vucevic. In it goes. That's his third bucket. He's missed five so far. Yeah, they're going to have a nice little run here. Outside Holiday, and it's an up top. Milwaukee, no good that time either. Bulls trail by 10. Here's DeRozan. Offensive rebound. Vucevic. He gets it to fall. That makes it just a single digit lead. Vucevic has got six here in this quarter. Outside Holiday. The pass to Matthews from past the arc. That shot, no good. And Chicago will go the other way with the ball. Pass to Vucevic. On the wing to Rosen. Hit by Vucevic from about 19 feet. And good, and it takes a nice bounce off the right iron and down. Milwaukee leading by six. And Milwaukee calls their first time out of the game. Yeah, things not going their way, and he wants to just try to talk this one over. And you know what, guys? If for nothing else, just to slow things down a little bit, change it up somewhat. All right. Coming out of the court, come on and get loud for your punts and speed. Back on it, Jim.
He's jumped in for Milwaukee. Allen comes in for Wesley Matthews. is it to Allen. And Zach Levine gets the whistle that time. That's his first call. I mean, I like the call. I thought the defense was just there a little late. Yeah, it looked like it. I mean, he kind of slid underneath as he got to the spot, too. Ozumu, he's checked in for Alex Caruso. Lopez sets a screen for Holiday. Driving the lane. Finds the bottom of the bucket from 13 feet out. Holiday's got seven points in the game. And the game of basketball is one of runs. And right now, this one's definitely not over. No, it certainly isn't. I mean, if they string together a few more baskets and get a couple of stops, I mean, this game will be tight again just like that. So stay tuned. And that one is good. Nine points in the game so far. And now look here, guys. I mean, Levine is a tough assignment. Don't make any mistakes about that. He's about 6'5 and has tremendous explosion off the floor. It's stolen by DeRozan. Oh, and a fast break for the Bulls. Pops it up for Levine. And the chicken Levine. by Levine. Beautiful, beautiful job closing the gap here. Let's see if they can sustain this run. This game was in danger of getting away from them. They've made a nice push to keep it close. With the step back. And Holiday kicks to Allen. Lopez, a screen on Williams. Shot clock at six. Here's Allen. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two and to the free throw line. That's his first personal. You know, I love how he absorbs the team. foul and still had a chance to knock that one down. Boy, terrific play there. I thought even with all the contact, he still was going to get that shot to go down. Half the line for two. And he can't get the first one. Carter, he's checked in for Drew Holiday. Then for the Bulls. Tristan Thompson, he's checked in for Vucevic. Derek Jones comes in for Williams. And it's Green in for DeMar DeRozan. And he sinks the second. Here's Chicago. They're on an 18 to 5 run here. And here is Dosumu. Passes it to Levine. Beyond the arc. Nailed from three point land. Levine's got seven points here in this quarter. You know, so far he's been dominant this period, making the most of his opportunities. Carter, the pass to Lopez. That one falls, coming off Carter's feet. Lopez has got his second basket of the night. Lopez is not the fastest guy coming out of the screen as a roller, but when he gets a step, he's hard to slow down. Those Zuma is the pass to Levine. Jones has the pick for Levine. An amazing finish with a hand right in his face. Levine's got 16. And off contact. Levine showing you what he can do. The improved strength making a big impact. Pass to Connaughton. Shoots from 12. Green with the rebound. And they haven't been able to turn it into a big lead, but their rebounding advantage is starting to add up. Yeah, still close, but with their tough play on the board, we're certainly seeing the effort. Chicago foul. Tristan Thompson. That's his first personal foul. 13 foul. He's 0-1 from the line, missing on his first trip. Chris Middleton. Taking two shots. And he knocks down the first one. Kobe White, he's checked in for the Bulls. Mm -hmm. 
Middleton hits them both. Bulls trail by four. Dosunmu, the pass to Jones. Here's White. And that comes off the assist by Jones. He has seven. And you have got to honor White on the perimeter. Once he gets comfortable from there, it's going to be bad news for the defense. Middleton can't get it to go. He's tried to get it going, but the shots simply have not been there. Nothing seems to be fall. White the pass to Thompson. Over Lopez. That doesn't go in. Had a chance, though, to take the lead. Carter dishes to Lopez. Kicks it to Middleton. Fires the three. The shot drops. His shot percentage improves. He's three for seven now. For that best presence of mind. Really important. You know, this game is more mental than physical. And Middleton is a guy who stays in the moment. He's exceptional at knocking down a good shot off a good pass. Good on that shot. With that, the Bucks lead is cut down to two on the bucket from Jones. And, you know, coaches will take possessions like that all day long. Phenomenal use of the screen there. Allen finds Carter. And out of bounds as the Bulls gain possession. The Bucks making a switch here. Hans de Kumbos checked in. Giannis Antetokounmpo. White, he'll bring it up for Chicago. One fifty-one left in the first half of the game. Jones, no one around him. And trying for the go-ahead basket, it doesn't go in. Jones with the screen on Allen. Here's White. That misses, had a chance to tie it there. Even though it's a point-blank range shot, that's not an easy one, especially when the defense is that tight. Giannis is double. A three ball. That's good from Allen on the assist by Giannis. And the Bucks lead by five. Ante Kumpo is a very gifted passer. Now, capable of running the offense and getting his guys going in the process. Here's White. A putback. Great positioning on the putback. Oh, how about the deft touch? right there guys he just guided that ball back up and in just a fingertip touch on the ball that's exactly right no need to catch it when you've got the kind of soft hand that he does he dishes it to Thompson that was a good screen to the paint it's all by to Kumbo four on three as they bring it up Allen passes to Lopez to the inside, and the slam dunk by Alex Kumbo. Set him up well there, Brook Lopez, showing his vision and willingness as a passer. And there's the pass to Jones. Here's White. And that comes off the assist by Jones. White's got a couple of three-pointers in the second for the Bulls. Middleton outside with the rebound. Boy, this is um, bad. Tough to watch. I mean, this is really bad. He's stone cold this point. Man. Dosunmu, the pass to White. From deep three-point range, and that shot was up. game so far for the first two quarters as we reach halftime. Bucks lead by two. It's time now to go courtside as we send you over to David Aldridge from the sideline. David, take it away. Thanks very much, Billy. I heard you tell the guys to take it to them and play with more physicality offensively. What did you mean? Well, just I think when we're getting the ball inside around the basket, at times we got to go up a little bit stronger and play through the contact and go to the rim. Tough sledding in there, but you got to get there. Thanks, Coach. Appreciate it. Back to you. 
Thank you, David. We'll be back after halftime for the start of the second half momentarily. Greetings, one and all. The postseason drama we love and no disappointment here as it's a close game so far for the Milwaukee Bucks. It's always a positive sign to see assist numbers like this. They're moving the rock with ease and keeping each other happy. It's a brand of unselfish basketball that's fun to watch and play. Seeing how things are shaking down for the Bucks. They held serve in game one. Shaq, how confident do they have to be for this one? Oh, they gotta be very confident, but not overconfident. They need to be Shaq for this. Well, I don't know about that, but they gotta continue to be assertive, right? You know, you can't count on momentum or the home court. It's all about your effort. I don't know what the heck Shaq put in is, but they can't count on that. Incisive analysis as usual. And now we send it down courtside for the second half. One, thanks for joining us as we get back to the action on the court. You look at Enid Kumbo in this one. He's been everywhere. And the way that he has helped out with the ball movement has been a difference maker early on. And, you know, that's not a job they ask him to do very often. But in the first half, I thought he was in perfect sync with his teammates. And we're happy to have you back for more playoff basketball here in round one. Long-time teammates Middleton and Giannis, the forward. Matthews out there with Holiday, and it's Lopez in at the five, patrolling the paint. That's the group for Milwaukee right now. And there's the foul. It goes on Wesley Matthews. That's his first foul. First team foul. Vucevic is screen on Holiday. A floater. And Lopez with his size is so good at just taking away space at the defensive end. And to the Kumbo finds Holiday. Outside Matthews. Pass to Middleton. Six on the shot clock. The dish to Lopez. Good, and the assist goes to Middleton. Lopez has got his team on the board first here in the second half for Milwaukee. This is a Caruso outside Levine. To the wing right side. And Vucevic hooks to Levine. Oh, and he almost had a four-point play right there. He'll go to the line with a chance for three. And Vucevic enjoys throwing his weight around now at 260 LBs. He's really good at finding ways to get to the line. And this is his second trip to the line in the game. One is off. No good on the second free throw. Another miss, and he's really struggling at the line. And so, under the Kumbo will bring it up for the ball. They led by as many as 18 points. Caruso looking for an opening. Giannis dishes to Matthews. Here's Middleton, and that one is stuck right through. Matthews has a nice field, guys, for when a teammate has a clean look, gets him the ball. 
Here's Caruso, recorded by Holiday. And the ball on Drew Holiday. That will get him his fourth foul of the game. Yeah, clearly struggling here with the foul. Still early. And just one more will put him over the limit. Third quarter here, over a minute and a half into it. Drills the three-pointer. DeRozan's got nine points. You know what, guys? I really think they want to see more of that from DeRozan. You know, make that three-point shot a bigger part of his arsenal. Back to Giannis. It's stolen by Vucevic. In the corner, it's Levine. DeRozan passes to Vucevic. And it's in after a nice bounce off the right side. He's got 10. You know, the mid-range game, guys, is really one of Nikola Vucevic's strong suits. I mean, you've got to play him honest if you're a defender. Back to Middleton. And oh boy, a lot of contact there, but he gets the call and will shoot two. That one off to Rosen. Really out of the right way defensively if you can't block, force him to the line. Yeah, exactly. Prevent the layup, give him a little bump, and then maybe they'll think twice about coming into the break. lane next Take time. And if they don't Two think shot. about it, at least they might be distracted by your presence. And he makes the first. Middleton hits them both. He's as solid as it gets from the line. I mean, give him the opportunity. He's cashing in on those. Caruso, the pass to Vucevic. There's the three. And it's to Rosen missing. Milwaukee leading by four. And how it gets to Andy Kumbo. A touch over two and a half minutes of basketball played here in the third quarter. Rebound collected by Levine. Levine's got six rebounds in the game. And it's good for two. Williams has got his second bucket of the night. Man, what a pass that was there. He really, really relishes making the game easier for his teammates. Here's Hunter Takumbo. And Hunter Takumbo screams it in. Persistence pays for Giannis there, using his athleticism and those long arm to collect second chance opportunities for his team. To the middle as Brook Lopez with the foul. That's foul number two for him. He's second board is he's checked in for the Bucks. Coming out of the floor for your Bucks. Here's Caruso. Right side Williams. The 11 footer and the rejection by Andy Kumbo. You know, one reason Giannis has won defensive player of the year is his agility and mobility. He can stay in front of guys and stay connected to shooters, too. Here's DeRozan. That's good, and it's Levine oh, with the assist. DeRozan's got five points in the quarter. And obviously his momentum from the last game has carried over here tonight. And you know, that's how it goes with him. I mean, his hot streaks, guys, don't last minutes. They last days. Portis, the pass to Holiday. Six to shoot. The Bucks need to get a shot off here. Portis can't get it to go. Well, that's a good player missing from point blank range. That's one you got to convert. For the time. And he gets it to go. Levine. Levine's got it all tied up now for Chicago. Well, this is what you admire about Levine's offensive game now. I mean, it isn't all threes and dunks. He's got some meat on that sandwich. Those plays can make a difference in a game like this. <laughs> well, you know it's going to fire up, Greg, everybody on that bench. Making a statement for sure. I mean, we'll see if they can maintain that aggressive approach, guys. Levine sets the screen for DeRozan. It's good, and it's his sixth make against 11 attempts. And here's Holiday, who will bring it up for Milwaukee. They led by as many as 18 points. Williams with the steal. 
Here's Caruso, guarded by Holiday. Some nice ball movement by the Bulls. Here's Vucevic, and the Bulls tack on two more. Vucevic. And taking a quick look here at the hustle stats for Chicago. Boy, they're hounding, harassing effort to the defensive end. Very impressive. And they forced quite a few turnovers as a result. And also, guys, they take a lot of pride in their ability to rebound the basketball, especially on the offensive end. On the wing, Levine. Lost to Vucevic. Here's Caruso. The wing would be down to five on the shot clock. On its way from DeRozan for two. Rebounded by the Bucks. Inside. Nice shot by Portis. Portis has got his first points of the night. How many times have we seen a possession take that from them today? Ending with the basket coming off a of brick pass. Well, when you look at the assist total, they have been clearly the better team. And it's Vucevic missing. It does not get much easier than that, but somehow he came up empty there. Middleton outside. Misses the three. After hitting one three in the first half, he's been unable to dial in from deep since then. DeRozan passes to Vucevic. Williams finds DeRozan. Over Holiday. DeRozan. That's good. DeRozan's got 15 points. Guys, you remember when DeMar DeRozan first came into the league? He was just really a raw athlete. Now he's a finely tuned offensive juggernaut. Here's Yacht. Good, and the assist goes to Middleton. Middleton's got his fourth assist with that last one here tonight. Bulls have gone 8 of 13 on shot attempts to begin the second half. Of the ball. here for the Bucks. Pat Connaughton is checked in for Chris Middleton. And Allen subbed in for Matthews. Chicago also making some changes. Green comes in for Patrick Williams. And it's wide in for Alex Caruso. Kumbo defending. High post shot. Vucevic with the bucket. Vucevic has got the game tied up here for the Bulls. Vucevic never losing sight of the basket despite the best efforts of the defense. That, folks, is real good focus. Allen surveying the D. On to Kumbo, a screen on Levine. Allen's shot is off. Chicago has gone one or two from beyond the arc since coming out of the break. Back to White, outside to Rosen. He kicks to White. Outside to Rosen. Shot clock at six. That's, it's close, but you know, didn't get on balance quick enough. Yeah, and as quick as players are at this level, in this day and age, I mean, you've got to be perfect in your anticipation to draw the charge. This is his first trip to the line tonight. as the free throw drops for him. Boy, DeRozan is a treat to watch. This guy is athletic, and he throws down some monster dunks. This dude is sick at the rim. That 
one falls, so he hits both of them. And so it's Holiday with it. They'll bring it up for Milwaukee. This is a two out to Takumbo. And they double up on to Takumbo. Outside Portis. Allen gets two out to Takumbo. Pocket six. There's the pass to Connaughton. Oh, and that one, no question. Powered it down. Getting better and better as a playmaker. Giannis is the ultimate team first superstar. He does put up big assist numbers in That's an evolving part of his game. Pass to DeRozan. And DeRozan throws it down. You've got to give them a lot of credit for just battling back into this game. Extremely impressive was the rally they made. I mean, we'll see how much their comeback might have taken out of them, and, and we'll see if they can keep that foot on the pedal now. Portis sets the pick for Anadokounmpo. Here's Connaughton. DeRozan defending. Anadokounmpo with the jam. Anadokounmpo is so long. I mean, he stretches forever. That was a ton of ground. And in terms of size, not your typical center, but man, he plays as big as any of them thanks to that terrific leaping ability. Allen with it, now guarded by DeRozan, and stolen by White. Last break, here comes Chicago, Levine with the ball. Excellent D there from Allen. The Bucks trail. Outside Portis passes it to Giannis. Allen outside. Just fine on the clock. Here's Connington. And onto Takumbo. Screams it in. Man, it would be kind of cool to be Giannis just one game. He makes Duncan get into the rim. It's so easy. On its way for the motion of the two. What a terrific move that was. He's got 21. And he's starting to show that killer instinct this quarter, looking to extend the lead. The drive by Giannis. And the slam dunk by Antetokounmpo. I'll tell you what, it's absolutely foolish and futile to let Antetokounmpo get space to sprint towards the rim. I mean, the dunks he jams home are just downright filthy, ugly, nasty wicked. Levine gets the green. To White. Shoots over Portis. And it's White missing. Milwaukee's gone one of four and three point shots here in the fourth. And Holiday has it in the corner. Shoots over Vucevic. And that one hits back on him. He operates well in traffic, but still, that's just a tough play to finish. No doubt about the consistency when it comes to scoring the basketball for him tonight. A real nice lift for their offense. This will make four trips to the line so far in the game. Brook Lopez has checked in for Milwaukee. Second team foul. One shot. At the line for the Bucks. Giannis Antetokounmpo. For one. That's good from out of the Kumbo. Bulls trail by three. Right the pass to green. 35 seconds left to play here in the third. The Bulls with another miss. Buck shooting so far, very efficient. All around, about 55%. Allen kicks to Lopez. Vucevic against Holland. A terrific shot on a turnaround. Holiday's got nine. Boy, what a sweet touch from the mid-range from Holiday. I like seeing him capitalize from this area of the floor. 
right side to Rosen. And they get it. Not able to get that one. The third quarter comes to a close. Milwaukee on top, leading by five. And right after this, we'll bring you the start of the final quarter right here on 2K Sports. And let's go back to a terrific pass that we're calling tonight our State Farm Assist of the Game. It's just true artistry right there. I mean, great decision on where to go with the ball. And how about the perfect delivery? And they'd love to see every possession in this way. True team basketball. And we're with you again as our round one coverage continues. So for Chicago right now, Michael Levine on the wing. Williams is out there with Vucevic, and it's Caruso in at the one. Middleton, a screen on one. Matthews passes to Middleton, and he takes the fantastic lead pass up strong for the slam. And they've done some nice work as we come down the stretch here in the final four. You can feel the sense of urgency they have to get this thing closed out as soon as possible. White against Hunter. White dishes to Williams. Vucevic trying to get over. Uses the glass to finish the lane. It's been like this all night for both teams. The offenses having their way. Any lull in the action so far has been short-lived because there have been nothing but buckets in this one. Right side Holiday. Middleton against Williams. And there are the Bucks with another bucket. They should continue to get the ball inside. The defense struggling to contain them. And when you make five in a row in close like that, it also takes pressure off your perimeter guys, too. Williams against Middleton. Levine sets the screen for Williams. To the paint. Yep, it goes in, and the Milwaukee lead is cut down now to just five on the basket from Levine. Yeah, with each passing season, Levine has grown into a larger role as an offensive player. And this is another huge night for him. Outside Holiday. And too long on the shot. And so White will bring it up for the Chicago Bulls. Kicks it to Vucevic. Levine passes to Caruso. Levine a screen on Hubbard. With the drive. Chalk up two there. Caruso. Milwaukee leading by three. Pass to Allen. Fires for three. Drills it from outside. Defensively, there was a lack of aggressiveness, and it really made it easy for him to knock that shot down. Fourth quarter of play, we're about two and a half minutes to do it right now. Oh, Vucevic in position, and it's the Bucks on the break. And Middleton, the bucket on the assist by Matthew. And it's an eight-point Milwaukee lead. And a closer look here with the hustle stats for the Bucks. The activity level defensively, I I've really been impressed with. They've been an attack mode on the defensive end. You know, adding on to that, you look at their block totals tonight, and you see how feisty they've been on the defensive end this game. Strong move to the 10, trying to get his guys going. Hard not to get motivated, GA, right when your teammate makes that kind of play. And you know, when you're looking to close the gap, you need guys who will take it upon themselves to step up, take the initiative, and make something happen. Williams kicks to Caruso. On the pass to Watt. Behind the fine Vucevic. It's a two up. Over Allen. The offensive rebound with the fadeaway. Vucevic with the bucket. Vucevic has got four points this quarter. And they're beginning to just flat out fall apart defensively right now. Especially on the interior. Yeah, and that's four straight field goals now if they've allowed from point blank range. Can't happen. And Nikola Vucevic is going to pick up the foul. He's third person up, and that'll be his third foul so far. Portis, he's checked in for Allen. And so it's Milwaukee now. They led by as many as 18 points. And there's the basket. This will blow his intense for a three-point play. Going to the line for one. And doing a really good job here 
pounding it inside in the second half. Sound strategy with the lead. Seventeen foul. At the line for the box. What's up? Free throw, no good for Holiday. Holiday really is a soft spoken guy on and off the court. Leads by example, is extremely reliable and talented. His teammates have great respect for him because of him. Middleton looking it over. Over Levine. That's short off the rim. Bulls trail by six. That's the Vucevic. Gets to the rim for two with the D all over him. Vucevic has got 14 points now in the second half. Outside Holiday. The fader. At basket number six to the stat sheet. He's now six for ten. This is one of the things that makes Holiday so, so good. He's able to concentrate at a high level even when the defense is right there. Ladies and gentlemen, your punch and sideline let's catch up with Hall of Famer David Alden. Well over that last break Kevin I got a chance to listen to what Billy Donovan said to his team. He told his guys the inside game is working so stick with it. That means posting, slashing, getting to the rim, whatever produces these high percentage looks. Kevin back to you. Thank you David. Bulls trail by six. Here's Caruso. Here's White. No oh, good with the triple. Not quite enough defense. That turn around, just lucky he was off. Pass to Ports. A shot by Middleton. Wide open. Bearings it from three-point lane. And now a nine-point bucks lead. Good up there. And he didn't waste it his second three. Lopez with the block. Levine against Holiday. Pass to Middleton. Yes, and it's Holiday with the assist that time. Middleton's got 26 points. A, a tough first half, but it's been a different story here since the break. Here's Caruso, defended by Middleton. White, wide open. He fights. Gets the three-pointer to fall. And this is someone that can really hurt you from long range. He did that to a degree in the first half, and he's doing it now. The pass to Middleton, launches it, and they get it back. Here is Holiday. He's tightly guarded. Just find the shoot. It's stolen by Vucevic. Caruso, the pass to Williams. He dishes it to Levine. Four on the shot clock. Good D by Lopez. Bucks leading by eight. Not loose. And here comes the break. Here's Caruso. Nice spin off the left rim and in. Caruso's got four points this quarter. And here's Holiday who will bring it up for Milwaukee. They led by as many as 18 points. Not going to go that time. So the Bulls will take it the other way. He takes it in. Oh! Yes, sir. My goodness. Oh, he got fancy with that one. Yeah, maybe trying to give them the momentum boost they need to break this game open. And I like it. I mean, some coaches might want to see just a sure-handed lay in there, but 
for me. Ball. I don't mind a little extra. Awesome rewind courtesy of the AT&T 5G Slam Camp. Two on the two, sir. All right, look who's coming out of the court. Come on and get down for your folks and see. The Bucks making a change here. Andrew Dacumbo's checked in. And the Bulls making a change here as well. Damar DeRozan. He's checked in for Kobe White. Holiday, the pass to Middleton. It's Andrew Dacumbo on the wing. Back to Portis. Shoots over Vucevic. And that one's on target from the wing. And the Bucks lead by six. Well, the, the pick didn't exactly neutralize the defender, but with good concentration on the finish, to still get the basket. Pass to Levine. On deep. Rebound, Milwaukee. Portis has got his sixth rebound on the night. To the middle. And the dunk by Giannis. Oh, inflicting some punishment with the two-hand flush. Ah, they're going for the throat. Now's the time to do it. Keep attacking that rim. Outside Levine. No one near him. A rebound by the box. He has to make that. I mean, you have to make the defense pay when they slough off of you like that. Middleton against Levine. Holiday of Spring on the beam. Here's Middleton and another basket for Milwaukee. Yeah, I like the fact that Middleton takes advantage of the mid range jump shot. He gets room to pull the trigger from there. He's taking it and he's almost automatic. And he makes that one. That's 23 points for DeMar DeRozan. I'll tell you what, what a good thing that he showed up today because without him, this thing would already be over. Side holiday. Matthews scanning the floor. Shot clock at six. Middleton for three. A three pointer is right on target. Middleton's got a pair of threes here in the fourth quarter for Milwaukee. DeRozan finds Vucevic. Outside Levine. Let's it go with the three. The shot's good. The assist by Vucevic. Vucevic has got three assists in the game. Levine, Holiday, no one around him. Again, Holiday missing. Chicago's gotten off four three corners in the final quarter, and two of them a fall. Now left to the wing. Vucevic dishes to Levine. DeRosa with it. Passes to Caruso. High post Vucevic. Five to shoot. Outside Williams. On deep. The rebound by Middleton. Middleton's got six rebounds in the game. Antetokounmpo gets to Holland. Nice ball movement by Milwaukee. Pass to Lopez. Over Levine. And again, the Bucks miss. Bulls trail by eight. On the wing, DeRozan. Defended by Middleton. And the wing jumper up off. Milwaukee's gone beyond the arc seven times here in the fourth and been successful three times. Outside, out of the Kumbo. Lopez finds Holiday, and here's Matthews. He's looking for Lopez, he finds him. Over Levine, and Lopez gets it to go. 
able to just go right over the top. I mean, the big man, Lopez, doing what? Tom Derozan, defended by Middleton. Vucevic is screen on Middleton. Derozan passes to Williams. Onto the green ball, pulls it in. Hey guys, that's going to wrap it up. Fans are piling out. The exit. Obviously, a huge win here. Game two for the Bucks. Well, the one thing that jumps out in this game is the free throw shooting which they did a much better job of. Absolutely. A, a big plus. And oftentimes your performance at the line can be the difference in a game. And I think tonight we saw that. And this is a team right now that is really playing with swag. Yeah, and anytime you can go up 2-0, you are in the driver's seat. They, they are riding pretty high going into game three. And you know, looking back at all the contributions tonight, it was a really phenomenal all-around game for Giannis Antetokounmpo. It was the kind of game for him that all scores dream up with a basket seemed as wide as a barrel. One second separate in the shot clock in game time. Pulls up. And the rejection by Giannis! And it's going to be out of bounds. The Bulls will retain possession. An outstanding defensive play to earn the mobile one block. And that block was something. It's the playoffs, and every possession and defensive style matters. Seconds left in the fourth quarter. Thompson a screen on Matthews. Here's Dosunmu. Out of bounds. Milwaukee takes possession. Well, he just didn't make the catch. Didn't look the ball into his hands. He must have thought the ball was going somewhere else. Now here is Carter. And so it's the Bucks taking care of business in this one. And this win puts them squarely in the driver's seat in this series. Up now break two zip with all the momentum on their side. I mean, in fantastic shape right now. If they can capitalize on this victory and win game three, you can just about throw this series to bed. And now let's catch up with David Aldridge, who's standing by from the sideline. All right, Dave. Thanks very much, Giannis. The team picked it up in the second half. What changed out there? We were playing actually really competitive. We were playing hard, but I think in the third quarter, you know, when you start making shots, you're going to play hard as defensively. And uh, we were moving the ball really well. And uh, we were just clicking as a team. And you guys controlled the last stretch, man. Thanks. Congrats. Back to you guys. David, thank you as always. And that about wraps it up for this broadcast of the NBA Eastern Conference quarterfinals. For Greg Anthony, Clark Kellogg, and David Aldridge, this is Kevin Harlan. Thanks for watching the NBA on 2K Sports. And now, we present the New Balance Player of the Game, Giannis Antetokounmpo.